Hey guys, we're back for another YouTube and this right here is what we're gonna do. A little uh, uh, Civil War soldier. This is the little uh, Southern fella here and this is the, the little Northern fella. Now he's a little taller. I, I did this one at a, at, at a, a carving contest and uh, it's just a little bit, it's the same size block, it's just a little taller. But he has eyes and a hand and and uh, it's a little uh, little different than this one here. But I'm gonna put him down and then uh, I'm gonna, uh, I used a, a block of wood here. It's three and a half inches long and uh, one and a half inch square. Uh, and, uh, and then here's the uh, one I drew on like that. And then I'll show you the um, the uh, actual cutout. This is the one we'll be working on today. This is the actual bandsaw cutout. And see, it fits right in there like that. Uh, now what we're going to do today is just remove a lot of wood and get the shape in. I don't know how many, probably two videos on this one. It's not a whole lot. But uh, I did want to show you all... Uh, the uh, carving I did from the last video, the detailed face, and that right there is the finished product there. I've got him painted, and I've got the magnets on the back for the refrigerator. Uh, and it was just a, a quick and fun little uh, project to do. And uh, But I'm gonna set this one down, and we're gonna get started on this guy here. And, uh, let me set him here. I did want to show you though, uh, I do have a wooden pattern and, and here is the paper pattern. Now this broke off here on the back, but this is the original and I drew this pattern from this. But let's just uh, put these down and we're gonna go ahead and, and get started. The first thing I wanna do, I wanna start uh, with a knife and start tapering this and getting the, the shape in there. <clears throat> I did have a little frontal view here, but we're going to redraw that on there in a little while anyway. I taper that and see, I, I, I draw a center line down it to keep it, keep it each side uh, even as much as possible. Let's see, I've got that tapered there. Now I'm gonna come here, start at the shoulder, and I'm gonna start tapering this a little bit. Is that looking all right, Peyton? Yep. All right. <clears throat> it's been a while since we, we've taped because we it's been uh, cold out. We had a big snowstorm, and I'm not, I mean, I'm sure everybody else has too, but my garage was just a little bit too cold. All right, I've got that tapered in there right now. Now what I wanna do is come in here, and I'm gonna start putting some shape in where these legs are gonna be. <clears throat> like that right there and I'm going to come in right here and this is a fun little project to do not a lot of work involved. Like I said, the um, he has no um, eyes, and his hands are in his pockets, so that makes it pretty, pretty good, pretty nice to carve. Well, 
let's see here. And what you want to do when you're doing this is you want to start thinking round. <clears throat> now I'm going to take my pencil and I'm going to draw on where this shoulder would be and the beard. I'm probably going to go ahead and cut this in with a V tool. <clears throat> Let me reach around and get my V tool. That's the size V tool I use. It's a it's a pretty good size one. About a 10 millimeter. Alright. I'm just developing the the shoulder and where the beard and hairline <clears throat> lies on this guy here. Now you can do this with a knife and you can even go in and uh, cut this guy out uh, with gouges and V-tools, but I just didn't, I'll, I'll show you a cut in just a minute on how to do that. Uh, now, since I've done this cut here, I'm gonna take and I'm gonna start uh, <clears throat> shaving this down a little bit more and giving this guy some shoulders and a chest area. Look like that right there, there's a shoulder. <clears throat> We can round this a little bit more right in here where this hat is. Like that right there. And while I'm in it, I'm gonna undercut this a little bit here to take off the bandsaw marks. And let's start thinking round right here on this hair. And I'll show you. Just a, not much more, but we do want to we do want to remove our the bandsaw marks from it. And, In just a minute, I'm gonna do the separations. Uh, <clears throat> now, while we're right here also, let's come in here and shave these bandsaw marks off the brim of this cap. Now, in this area, you you need to be careful because uh, uh, you don't want to break this brim off. And I'm going to come across here. What are we doing on time, Peyton? We've got about nine minutes. Nine, and then we're on for 18? Okay. Yep. Okay. <clears throat> now I am going to start removing a little bit more wood right in here. And... Um, what I need to do is go in and draw here where this cap, where his cap comes in. Now this uh, this particular carving, it doesn't necessarily have to be Civil War soldiers. You could take that off and put a ball cap on him and he could be a farmer or or you could make it around it and, and make a Santa Claus out of this. It's not subject to uh, just what I'm doing here. But I, I'm, I'm doing this one because I've got one already carved uh, uh, to show you. Now, 
when I put that line in, I'm gonna go in and, and make this a, just a little bead cut across here and kind of tuck that uh, hair up under this cap. Now I can start tapering this front of this face right in here toward my center line. And what we're doing today, we're really just putting in the shape of this guy. On the next video, we'll go in and we'll do the other the other detail on this guy. And see, I'm just kind of tucking that hair up underneath there, bringing that nose up right in there where the nose will be. Now, I've done this this old guy several times, but he was a uh, he goes way back. I I did one like this years ago, um, and uh, gave plenty of them away to my family and and friends. And um, let me tuck this in a little bit now. Let's start tapering this chest area a little bit. All right. Where are we at, Peyton, on time? We got about five minutes. Oh, okay. Yeah, on this guy here, we're going to, uh, uh, do him uh, like when I cut off, I'm not going to go and do a little bit on it. I'm just going to start from where we left off. And let's shave these marks off and, and my pencil lines. Just getting that taper in there. Now let's come right in here and take these little sharp corners out. Well, he's taking shape. That's what we want. And I'm gonna try to get another video done next week. Uh, but I'm going to be headed down to Clearwater, Florida to teach a class there in Florida and in March. And then I'm also going, to, uh, after that, in March, I'm going to be at the Renegade Woodcarver's Roundup. I'm teaching a, a pre-class there, uh, two and a half days, but I... The rest of the week, I'm just going to be there carving for the fun. All right, let's see here. I'm going to draw some lines on here, too. Where are we at time-wise, Peyton? We've got about three minutes. Okay. Let's round this hat a little bit. Well, let's see here. Let me take my B tool and come across here and kind of clean that up a little bit and run it across there like that to where that brim stops. Now, 
I'm gonna go in right here. You can see the lines where I drew that, where that nose will be. Uh, his hair, will, he's gonna have a hair lock coming down like this and right here. And then he's gonna have an ear right there and an ear on this side. Now I am gonna cut this nose in uh, <clears throat> right now so we can develop that. I'm just gonna, first of all, it's just gonna be a little square. May have to do a little bit more tapering in there, but I gotta get that nose to stand out when I look at it from the side. Hmm. You see that all right, Peyton? Yep. All right, let's see here. All right, I've cut this here, so I need to cut back against my stop cut right in here. There, that little nose. You start it out square and then you kind of kind of round it at the bottom. Yeah, let's take some more of off this area off right in here. All right, well, anyway, I want to show you here uh, that's where we're gonna stop right today. Uh, he's looking pretty good. We've got to uh, taper this side and uh, and then we'll uh, start from, uh, go from there on the next YouTube. And uh, one more thing I, before we cut off, I wanna draw these lines back. That hair goes up to, to his nose and it covers, it's gonna be covering his eyes like like that right in there. And we will have to taper these shoulders in this way a little bit. But anyway, guys, with uh, with that right there, I'm going to leave you with it. And uh, uh, on the next YouTube, we'll, we'll go ahead and fin uh, well, I'll try to get him finished up. But we may do three videos on this. Just take our time on it and, and go from there. So... In, until the next uh, video, uh, happy carving to everyone, and uh, uh, we'll see you later. Bye. I mean